Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Yamak and today another backpack review. One of my favorites is the Alta 21 from Arcadia. Um, I got this from Kickstarter in 2018, so it's been on, I've been using it for three years and I want to tell you guys all about it. So the backpack came also with its own compression bag. So it's uh, you can store it and make it really small and put it in your big backpack or in your suitcase and then when you're on your location you can get this bo boy out of it and then use it of course so let's unpack it all right to be honest i haven't been using this at all because i use the backpack almost every day so i don't need to stow it away but i suppose for travel it can be handy the backpack comes in three colors this is the cobalt blue version and you have the onyx black which i gave to my mother and the garnet red let's grab this you might see that it's been uh, put some to some good use i think i've had it for three years now so it's still holding up of course there are some signs of wear and tear but i think that's normal after three years all right so let's show you guys what this bad boy can do it seems like an ordinary bag but there's a lot of things special about this one first of all um, it's really light well you saw how small it can become so i think for daily use it's my favorite little backpack i use it when walking and when doing groceries and yeah i think also for long hikes it's perfect as long as your carry doesn't become too heavy because then you will notice it it doesn't give you much support but for everything you use on the uh, which is light it's great all right let me show you all the features it has all the basics of course on the front uh, front pocket and the good thing is it's uh, it has ykk zippers which are waterproof so now water can enter it and even in, in heavy rain uh, it, it stays dry so that's great so it has two mesh pockets on the sides for your water bottles which is great and uh, like i said it's it's really light but also sturdy and flexible all right now the extra features come up on the top you see it has a roll top and if you roll it i think three times and then buckle it up it's also waterproof so nothing can enter and what's even more uh, special is you see on the top there's a zipper and you might seem think that's weird why is there a zipper up here but it has something special let me show you guys it has an accessory which you can attach on the top and let me unpack this one moment it comes also with his uh, little pocket sack this is uh, a hip belt a hip pack i think it's three liters three or four liters and so you can use it standalone right it's great for travel to put your documents here and your essentials to be honest i haven't been using that uh, myself but <laughs> i think if you're someone who is into hip packs this can be great also waterproof ykk zippers but what makes it great is you can also combine these two so let me show you guys let me let's sit down for that so th we can put this away like so and on this side as well there you go and now you can combine these two let's see here we start all right so there we go let's align them properly I think 
it must be like this let's try it one more time there we go see like so so now it looks more like a regular backpack but it's really functional so let's put it on my back and sh show you some more extras all right it has a sternum strap it has a hip strap I'm not really using these straps that often especially because my load won't be really heavy in this one but now and then it can be handy so now it's really tight to my body and what's even neat is the sternum strap has a little whistle so let's try it out <laughs> All right. one more time let's try it I think the dog heard it see dogs hear it <laughs> so this is great for calling your dog or getting some attention if you're in some t trouble I guess haven't uh, been uh, haven't used it myself but I think it's handy just in case so this is great here you can attach your sunglasses like so so it has all the basics right but there's even more how is it possible you would say with such a standard little backpack but here we go so on the back you see a mesh liner and then underneath see I, I let's close it up first underneath there's a hidden pocket so you can open it up and then put something here look you can't see my hand there are actually two compartments so you can either put like a little blanket here but they have something extra let me grab it it's called a uh, inflatable back support see I've inflated already so you can put this here and this came all free by the way all the accessories all right so that's the back support and then you can close it up and now it's a bit softer on your back especially when you care, uh, carry a lot of gear that might be hand, uh, handful but it's a little extra and I, I haven't used it myself because like I said I don't use it for heavy carry but it's really good you get it for free and you can also use it just to sit down somewhere and have a nice comfortable cushion <laughs> all right but there's even more instead of the back support you can also put like a water pack inside this is a three liter osprey water pack and it's not really suited for this one i think it's a bit too big let's see with a little bit cinching it goes right here so you can also hide it away if you want like so so if you go on a longer hike this could be ideal but to be honest I haven't used it in that combination what I do uh, what I did use here uh, this compartment for is <laughs> one time when I went to a festival I put away some some extra snacks here and it was invisible so yeah <laughs> I think it's a great feature feature and uh, you can use it all the way you want apparently you can also put a 11 inch or maybe 13 inch laptop here but I think that's not really smart since this backpack doesn't give much support to your laptop so be careful not to drop it all right so this is a great flexible backpack and I think uh, for daily use it's really one of my favorites because it's so light and even when you do a lot of groceries you can see you can keep it open at least if it's not raining right or try to cinch it down like this so you can uh, carry a lot of groceries which are not heavy usually but they take a lot of space so this is great for that and just for uh, maybe going to the gym carrying some light stuff and I will show you my red one 
So this is uh, after three years of use. Some wear and tear. See the mesh on the back. I think I put my uh, battery pack inside, which was a bit too heavy and damaged it a, lo a little bit. So that's a shame. And also on the front, I had a hole here and with some duct tape I sealed it. So it's not, not something really deal breaking, but it's still in a f really good shape. And I think I, one of my hip belt clippers is gone. <laughs> Just small stuff. But the back itself is still functional after three years. So I'm really happy with this one. So how expensive was it? Let me have a peek. I've got three of them, right? The black, the red and the blue for together for 210 US dollars. So that makes it around 70 per bag, which is not cheap, of course. But like, as you see, it's really a multi-purpose multi bag and it holds up really well. So I would say it's worth it especially if you if you want something that's really light all right guys what do you think of the alta 21 backpack it's uh, by arcadia supplies and um, i will put some some links links in the comment section i really like it as you can as you can tell all right guys that's it for this one i'll see you guys in the next one do you take the red pill or the blue pill <laughs>